So hey everyone, welcome again on the Stack channel. So in this video, we are going to discuss about a tool that is really helpful for a developer. Like it will make your life more easy uh, using these uh, tools. Okay. So like I will give you a scenario, but let me uh, tell you about uh, pieces that pieces is a tool that save the code snippet. Okay. So I will give you a scenario that uh, yeah, you are working with a project and you found a kind of a problem while working on the project that you are not able to solve easily and uh, you search on a Google and you found a stack overflow solution. Okay. So this is a kind of a question, a problem you search on a Google and you found a solution for it. Okay and uh, yeah that's good and you found a solution over here and uh, now you forgot that what was the problem and what was the solution now what happened that after two or three months you got a same problem okay in your another project okay and uh, now you have to find out the same solution which you use on the last project right so that is kind of hectic okay um for this case, either you maintain the snippet on your own GitHub account or you have to put this uh, this code in somewhere like so th that is kind of hectic that when you will need a piece of code which you find a two month back for some other project. Okay, to solve this thing, the pieces come into the uh, unique idea that it will save the piece of code. Okay, on their editor okay so this is not an editor that they have one software or you can save the snippet of code okay and use it uh, after two months or three months or anywhere okay w w once th uh, that will require so suppose i am working on a portfolio project and i need this code right now okay so after two or three months i am working on a different project like web dashboard project so i will need this piece of code again so i have to find out this exact question and the solution in the google and that is kind of hectic so instead of doing that thing what i can do that i have a pieces extension i will tell you that how you configure the pieces in a next video but i'm just giving you a feature explanation of the pieces okay and here we have a button and we have to just click on a save okay so what pieces will do that in a pieces uh, editor it will save it so here you can find it that the piece of code which i clicked here which is saved over here okay so in a future if my another project if i will need this amount of code i just have to copy it and i just have to use it i don't need to go on a google and search it again and find the exact solution because i already had a perfect solution for the old project and now i wanted to use the same kind of solution on my other project okay so this is a base feature i came across so pieces will help you to save the code not only the browser so like i told you the example of the browser okay so this is a extension we use in a browser okay Similarly, we have extension for the VS code or IntelliJ editor also. Okay. So suppose in uh, some, uh, in some later of point that you had some code did. Okay. And you need a exact code in other project. Okay. So what you have to do, you have to download a pieces extension. I will explain you that part in the next video don't worry so the pieces extension you can add it on a chrome or you can also add it on a vs code or intellij so we have a section on a pieces that what are the plugins i mean what are the platform they support as of now so you can find out your own editor is right now supported or not like i work with the vs code so i have added the extension of the vs code on my system it also come for the jetbrains and ultra edit and as of now browser 
okay, is Google Chrome and the Microsoft Edge. Okay, so I have added that extension on the VS Code. I will explain you in the next video that how you can add it, those things. So here you will get an option, save pieces, and that piece of code will again go on the pieces software and uh, how you will download it i will explain you in our next video don't worry so here you have a multiple thing you can copy a code okay you can also delete the code you have a feature you can explore it download the code okay so you can change the theme i guess i i am not sure pretty much sure as of now as of now it is supporting this amount of uh, uh languages so yeah you can create your own code instead of adding by extension you can create your own snippet over here to use it in a future and you just have to copy it and use it anywhere in your other projects so that's it uh, that is a code snippet saving tool and it will ease your life in day to day developments and it is completely free so you can explore it i will put the uh, link of this software in the description go and check it out and use it thank you all and in the next video i will show you that how you can download it and configure it for the mac os okay so thank you all see you on our next video